Hey guys, it's Cats. Welcome to the channel. I only work tomorrow and Wednesday. I should figure out what to do. It's my time. I found this like app for a bullet journal. So I've been using that for the past few days. It's actually really cool. So this one obviously is just a calendar for the next few months. I'm not finished with it. And the only cute one is October. <laughs> so <clears throat> I have August. September. Obviously, this is not accurate. It's just to keep it there. Got a picture of Jordy in there. Look at that picture of Jordy. She's so cute. Speaking of the devil. What? And then, of course, the only cute one is fall. <laughs> hey, go. So, Halloween, October. Movie checklist, list, fall bucket list. I think that's it, yeah. And then I also have these. This is for journaling. This is for like works in progress. And then I like to keep a work journal. Why, I don't know, I just do. So I got that one. Also, I got bored and rearranged my room. So here's what it looks like now. Obviously my bed, bed to table, altar. That's kind of, that's in the same place. My mirror's over there. That was always over there. Put my TV all the way over there, which I don't love, but I'll figure it out later. Trash can, random shit. And then my bookshelf. So fun fact about me, I am obsessed with The Sims. I play it like it's my job. And I, just last night, um, because I couldn't sleep, I went through the entire game, like all of the like neighborhoods that I have. And every house is like gone. And unless like I have Sims that I'm playing in their houses, every house in my Sims game is gone. So that way I have more open lots. But the house that, I am working on right now is not the exact layout, but it is kind of like inspired by my mom's house. And I made my little family. So look. Hey, Bubba. What are you doing? All right, so there's me. No, that's a lie. That's my dad. That's my mom. That's me. That's my sister. So this is a little porch area, obviously, entryway bathroom my room my sister's room this part is kind of accurate the length of the house is not which is why it's not exactly accurate but my sister's rooms are at the end of one house and we're across the hall from each other and then i have a bathroom right next to my room she technically has a laundry room next to her room and i did have the laundry room but i didn't know what to put in it so i just removed that wall separation and so this entire space is just living room uh parents room master bedroom and then the kitchen i obviously still need to do some decorating i got this is cole's room i'm gonna do some more stuff with it and then this is my room this is a graffiti wall because i have the um whatchamacallit city life city living something pack and you can do graffiti on walls and then this is the back door. We've got a pool, some chairs. This is a telescope. Yeah, telescope. And then I made this little like not gazebo but gazebo thing. And then yeah, that's pretty much it. And then I obviously still have some decorating to do. Me and Devin made a run to World Market and to Costco. Oh, my coffee's over there. So from World Market, it kind of spilled it a little bit, so the cup is dirty. It's wet. But I got this cute little like white checkered mug and I made myself a caramel iced coffee. We also picked up cold brew and creamer, hence the coffee. So fun little haul. I got more tea lights because I have a wax burner and not tea lights. So it's kind of an essential hand lotion. It smells like coconut. What are you doing, Boba? Shorts because it's hot as shit and I have like four pairs of shorts and they're all very old and are starting to not fit me because they're getting so stretched out. So more shorts, a bath bomb this is from World Market. I'm probably going to use this tonight because I could use a good de-stress. And then I found a knit blazer that I'm gonna wear when it gets closer to like fall. And also, blah, blah, blah. Also for fall, I got 
a new pajama set and they're like blue and they have stars all over them. Okay, so look at how fucking cute these are. First of all, these are so nice, so soft. Oh my god, it has a little push, it has a pocket. I love that. And I also kind of like that the shoulders or the sleeves or whatever have the same design as the pocket. And then they have these pockets. This is so cute. I am obsessed with this. <laughs> It is about 10.15. I have work at 12. I really want to shower. I had the sad realization that today marks the two month anniversary of my dad's passing. Is it just past like 10.30 p.m.? Last month on the month anniversary of his passing, I didn't sleep at all. And I didn't even work the following day, so it was a little bit easier to like except I'm really worried that this is going to be a cycle that on the anniversary of his passing every month I'm not going to sleep well if I do it all I really thought I'd be fine I started watching Raw, the episode from yesterday because I watch it on Hulu and I think it uploads the next day on Monday they were in Winnipeg <laughs> which is in Canada. My dad's not even from Winnipeg. <laughs> I don't know why. It just instantly made me start crying. My dad is from Oshawa, Ontario. No, oh my God. My dad is from Oshawa, Ottawa in Canada. Tonight's gonna fucking suck. I mean, if I don't sleep tonight, it's kind of whatever. I just realized something. When I was at work, I was taking the temps for one of our fridges in the front right before I closed, and the exact temperature was 33.3. And he even commented on it and was like, oh my god, 333, ha ha ha, that's so funny. 333 is the angel number for your guides watching over you. Devin and I saw geese flying uh yesterday not today and i pointed them out and i was like oh my god it's geese and then i just shouted out hey dad i miss you i miss my dad i would take a shot for him but i don't want to go downstairs or leave my bed but I do a glass of wine. <laughs> I do have a glass of wine. So, let's see if I can do this without crying. Here's to you, and here's to me. And here's to friends I hope will be. And if friends we cannot be, to hell with you. Here's to me. I was supposed to go to work today. I just woke up feeling terrible. Woke up so tired and I feel sick. So I'm getting, I'm getting kitty cuddles. What were you doing? I'm probably just gonna sleep all day. Hey. 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 Ow. Ow. Yeah. No. That hurts. You're being mean to me. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Why are you being mean?
I'm definitely gonna sleep most of the day or walk around or do anything because my vertigo is being weird. You're biting your own tail. I don't think you're meaning to do that. This is Sunday, August 1st. So I just put stickers over it. Movie checklist, fall bucket list. October calendar. And then starting with weekly, I have two birthdays right here. Devin's birthday is on the 4th and so is our other friends. Some cute little stickers. And then this is like the end of that month. I might change this up. I'm not obsessed with this. I like these two. I don't know how I feel about the watercolor, but I'll figure it out. I don't really have any plans for my day except for just relaxing, trying to make myself feel better. All right, so Devin and I just went to Five and Below so I can get some stuff for my friend's birthday because I am going to hang out with them later tonight. So, I got this pen for them because they like, like, punny pens. So I got that for them. And then I also got a card. I got them this Autumn Squishmallow because I collect them. So I got that. I got some Swedish candy. Why are you eating my laces? I got a bunch of mini Starbursts. These are some of my favorite candies. They're called Zots. And they have this like fizzy candy. Hi, baby. It's like fizzy candy inside of them. I got 10 because they're 10 for a dollar. Also got them this shirt. I'm actually not positive that it will fit them because I don't know for sure what their shirt size is, but it's fine. Perfect. Amazing. Good morning. <coughs> it is 5.53 in the morning on Saturday on my day off. And there's a train in the background. Me, Devin, and one of my coworkers, Clementine, made plans to take a day trip to Charlotte today. Because Charlotte is having their Pride Festival today. And we made the stupid decision to want to be in Charlotte by like 9 a.m. So we have to leave for Charlotte by 7.30 in the morning. I already have my outfit picked out, thank fucking God. I just have to get ready. I'm gonna miss you. I'm gonna be gone all day. I wish I could bring you with me. All right, here is the fit. I'm so tired. And then I have on oh, my pride bands. <laughs> it's currently 7.09 in the morning. I shockingly slept really good, but I'm still very tired. I did not. You didn't sleep well? No. Uh oh, all right, here. Anyway, got the homeboy here. Pride, bitches. <laughs> I said that on his vlog, so now he's retaliated. <laughs> hey, anyway, uh, we are on our way to go. Send the mood. <laughs> we are on our way to go pick up Clementine, and then we have like what an hour and a half drive to Charlotte. Hour fifteen ish. Hour fifteen, but it's fine because I got my blanket and Devin's camera, and I have a book in my bag, so I'm not like a oh, fucking bus. So I'm not too well, you said bored. You had Oh, rock? I probably it's not just do. A it's a rock. rock! I probably will have rocks in my bag eventually. I fucking love rocks. <laughs>
you excited for your first bride? Hell yeah, <laughs> So we didn't know what time to get here. <laughs> and we just like, we ate at Amelie's. Is that how you say it? Amelie's? Yeah, we had Amelie's. Amelie. It's not Emily's, it's Amelie's, which is this gorgeous French restaurant. And uh, the parade doesn't start until 12. It is 10, 14. <laughs> but they are people like setting up fucking sun glare. And it goes like all the way, where's my arm? All the way over there, all the way back there. So right now we're just like sitting down, hanging out. But bitch, I, oh, I'm so excited. So bubbly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, do the rainbow fly. I don't know what order is going. Oh my god, that flashlight. No! Uh, <laughs> Disgraceful! Gosh! time we got home last night. I know it was before like 5 p.m. It was Clementine had something to do in Greensboro. So we had to get home before then. So I didn't get a lot at Pride. I got a lot of free necklaces. Um I got this Hele bracelet. So I got that. I got this rubber rainbow bracelet which I didn't even even realize said Walgreens on it until like two hours after I got it. I still have on my Bud Light thing, which they put on upside down, so that kind of bothered me. I got a miniature pansexual flag. <laughs> I got two different like keychains or lanyards. I got the trans one and I got the pansexual one, but I combined them to make a like, what's it called? A chain or something, handle, whatever, for my Polaroid camera. I've always wanted one of these shirts and I'm really glad that I got to buy one. I get a Protect Trans Kid shirt. I think that was it. Oh, that's not it. I lied. They're heading out. Car air fresheners. So I got one. I have three right now. I had four, but one snapped while it was like in my bag or something. Oh, and then I also got a clipper thingy from North Carolina Zoo because they had a tent up at the festival for some reason. But I've actually been needing one of these. So I got one. I put it on my ankle. I also got one of these. Oh, there's a trans one on the inside. I didn't even realize that. So I don't know what TD stands for, but That was my week. <laughs> and I'm just gonna go chill for the rest of the day. Just because of yesterday alone, my social battery is like gonna be empty for the next three days. So <clears throat> I'm still so tired and I slept from 5 p.m. to nine in the morning. That concludes my weekly vlog. Thank you for watching. <laughs> And I'll see you later.